welcome to Blue Harvest Toys and yes we're going to be doing another review I know we're doing a lot of reviews lately but uh, something a bit different we've got Star Trek we've got Captain Kirk these new Playmates figures uh, slightly taller than the um, other ones the, the last lot that came out um, they did have all all the range cube code like that they did have all the range in Forbidden Planet, um, but I had to get Kirk. I was thinking about getting Khan. I might get Khan to go with Kirk. I've, I've got the Mego ones, all three. I just love the uniform, and it's Captain Kirk. We've got to get Captain Kirk. It's just the uniform for me. I, I do love the Next Generation Discovery, not so much, but um, yeah. Playmates have just brought these re-released, not re-released, the different, the different moulds and things like that. Uh, I just why why do they put the bubble on the other side of it? Anyway, so yeah, playmates brought them back out. Got the license again, but they're not they're not rehashing the old figures. I do have some of the uh, next generation. I've got Edith Keeler actually. I might put him with her. <laughs> but we're going to open this out. Oh, should I? Should I? Yeah, go on, man. We're going to open this. Oops. Yeah, it's not. I don't think I'm ever going to get William Shatner's autograph. And if I did, I'd just go buy another one. All, it was only £12.99, believe it or not. Look, 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 Hasbro. You get a stand. So, yeah, I, I just love this packaging. It's pretty cool. And the way it is, it is shaped, you could actually put them on the wall next to each other which is pretty cool but it's too late I've just opened it anyway <laughs> so we're gonna um, let's get the stand out generic plastic stand it's not nothing to write home about but it is uh, a Starfleet symbol which has become more it is the Enterprise symbol isn't it? It always has been, but it's now Starfleet symbol, and I don't think the current. I don't really want to go a lot of it, but the current current people who are making Star Trek don't understand that. I don't think. It's, uh, I, I, I won't go into it. <laughs> it's too long, too boring. We can have a discussion about it at another time, maybe. I'm gonna leave it in comments. If you want to know, I'll, I'll let you know about that. So, what have we got here? See, for £12.99 you're getting a figure and accessories. And Playmates have always done the little accessories, not being a brilliant, brilliant accessories, but the playability, there's playability there. There's actual playability and you can play with these figures. So we'll look at Kirk first. Ooh. His legs are off. <laughs> what? <laughs> Very wobbly legs. Very wobbly. Yeah. All his limbs are like... His head's quite pretty stiff. Yeah. Look at that. Woo! Anyway, let's look at the sculpt. Now... Um, looks a bit younger than Star Trek II Kirk. The paint apps have missed a bit of his hair there. The, the articulation is not brilliant. It's not bad, but yeah, I, d I wonder if they expect you to keep these in the in the. I don't suppose they expect you to keep them on the card because you give the accessories, but maybe they're just there just because. Um, the uniform, yeah, the paint apps on the uniform are not brilliant either. I know it's it's a smaller figure, so they they're gonna. They're going to have trouble. They're going to have trouble. Um, they've got the Ace Admiral insignia on there. There we go. It's got all his correct insignia. As I say, I do love this uniform. This is the best uniform they did ever did in Star Trek. And I would love to have... If, if I was going to have any uniform, I would have that one. Probably not brilliant to wear, but yeah, it's just that just looks so good. I just uh, yeah, it's uh, 
this hip movement is too loose for me. That is, I think that that would easily fall out. That's easily going to come out. That's not not the best. You know, I, I wonder if they're just cutting costs just because it's it is twelve ninety nine. Doing it at a good price point, so they're doing it um, to keep it down to twelve ninety nine with accessories and a stand. Which the sculpt uh, from that angle, it's not so bad. From the front, it's yeah, you know it is, you know it is. So we've got um, kind of two. We've got we've got one trigger finger. We've got two. Really got two trigger fingers, don't we? So. We're gonna to have to put the, the phaser in one hand. And I'm not so sure about the phaser. Is that quite what it should be? It looks more like a hairdryer. I don't know. Um, he's got his communicator, which I assume just clips on his wrist. And he's got a, a pad. Captain's log, which doesn't it doesn't hold. Is that going? I don't know. Is that going there? Uh, maybe I've got the. Maybe he's he's supposed to hold that there, and that and that hand. I didn't think William Shatner was left-handed, but yeah, it's uh, not the best accessories. Maybe. Maybe they did expect you to keep it in the on the card. Yeah. Um, we're gonna, we'll put him on his stand because we're going to have to. I don't think he'd stand up by himself. Oh, he will. Yeah. Dyna dynamic pose. And there goes uh, Ayla. Talking and standing up. Do you want to her? Uh, I think she's had a bit of a fit. There we go. We're going to put it on the stand. Hmm. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, these accessories are a bit pointless. But then again, you've got you've got trigger fingers. And it's it's, it's very wobbly. <laughs> but yeah, it's uh it's all right. It's just all right. Not going to get them all. Definitely not going to get them all. Um, I might get a couple. I might get. I don't know if I want to get Spock because he's got his. Why? Why have all Spock figures got the, the Vulcan solo? Um, yeah. Uh, a can. I might get Can. I might get Spock just because he's in this uniform. Hopefully, they do the whole, the whole uh, bridge crew. That'd be pretty cool. So there we go, a quick review there. Um, I love Star Trek. So it, it were a must buy. I had to get it. And 12 99 it's not too bad. So there we go, thank you for watching. Until the next video, Bad Toys be with you.